Jonathan from Rain Brothers here, rainbrothers.com. Today we're going to go over installation of our new single outlet Mondulin filter. This is a great, great pre-filter for, uh, for cistern. Um, the first step in installing it is going to be, there's a, there's a flathead uh, screw right there. You're going to take this cover off and there's a Phillips head screw right here that you're going to undo and that will pull this filter, you're going to pull this filter down and leave it hang right there. That makes mounting it very easy. The second thing you're going to want to do is know what size downspout you have. In this case, this is a 2x3 aluminum downspout. So I got a 2x3 downspout adapter and I used PVC cement and PVC primer to adhere this downspout adapter on the top inlet on the filter. You're gonna notice that the fitting is loose on there. It's a, it's a, it's a um, actually a Brazilian pipe size, but it's very close to the American pipe size. Um, but if you if you uh, have a nice thick coat of PVC cement and just let it sit on there for a while, it will be a very tight seal. Um, you're gonna wanna make sure it's lined up uh, with the filter that's running parallel. And then once that, once you let that set for a, a minute to harden, we're just gonna um, loosen up the downspout from the wall. Uh, this is a pre-existing drain, so we're just tying into this. And we're gonna make a mark on the downspout where to cut. Um, so essentially, we wanna make sure we have a pipe adapter for this. If you put a coupling on your four inch pipe, this will fit inside any coupling, either SDR 35 or Schedule 40. And then you're gonna to wanna to make a mark so that the downspout goes into this downspout adapter. So we're gonna cut, we're gonna make a mark here on the downspout and put in a, a, a coupling on here and get this fitted. Okay, so we have our coupling for our PVC pipe here. We're just gonna glue this onto the stand pipe. Again, this was existing drainage. This is just a retrofit. We have a coupling in there. We have our downspout cut where we want it. Now we're just going to insert this downspout right into that downspout adapter and insert it into the into the coupling. Um, once we do that, we're going to make sure we're nice and level. We're going to use uh, self-piercing screws. That's usually the best for mounting into siding. You may have different type of siding, so you may need something different. But for vinyl siding, self piercing screws are perfect. Because of the depth of this filter, I just stacked bits. Uh, so I'm, I, I got three, I got a, a sleeve bit and two quarter inch hex head bits. And that just gives me a little extra extension. And you can use these self piercing screws to go straight through the fiberglass on the filter to secure it to the wall. So we're going to use two self tapper or self piercing screws to mount this. And now we're just going to use going to make sure our downspout is nice and lined up. Plumb. Uh, we're going to use this downspout to do to get our plumb line and put another self piercing screw through this PVC adapter, this PVC coupling, to uh, drill into that bottom outlet. At this point, we have everything mounted. You can also put a couple uh, self-piercing screws up here to secure that downspout. But then we're going to line this hole on the filter up with this mounting hole. Just like that. We'll put our, our Phillips head screw in there and then put the plate back on and we're going to make sure that this string is, is mounted around this pulley. This is what causes this filter to flex down. So as rain comes down, it weighs this down, it flexes, clean water pours out this filter screen while debris passes straight through. You will not have much loss on this discharge side so you can leave this open. Um, it's not going to be any more water coming through here than is falling through the sky. 
um, and you'll notice if this filter starts to clog and it needs to be cleaned, you'll notice more water being discharged here. So that's a good indication that you need to pull the filter out, wash it down, and we have videos on how to do that on our product page. This, again, this is the Mondulin single outlet filter. It will filter rainwater um, to about a, a 70 micron level, um, and it'll filter 1,200 square feet of roof. Thanks so much for watching. Again, Jonathan from Rain Brothers, rainbrothers.com.